Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Venkate. I am a DevOps engineer. This is a DevOps Pro Junction YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see one of the topic with variables. I have made a video related to Terraform variables. If you not had seen those videos, you can watch those videos so that you can easily understand this video. So in this video, we are going to see why we need Terraform.tfwar file. The reason behind behind why is to overwrite your variable.tf file you have given some value let's see the demo so in this uh, configuration file you can see uh, there are four uh, tf files one is main.tf provider.tf variable.tf and another file which i named as terraform.tfwars this should be the default name you have to provide so normally we have variable.tf file when it comes to variable.tf file it is going to replace the key value which we are going to given in the variable block so that's what it is going to do so here you can see that i have given the ec2 instance type which is t2.micro and uh, ec2 instance count is uh, 3 one of my colleague want to use my script and he don't want to overwrite my variable.tf file so in that case what he can do uh, he can create a terraform.tf file so what it will do why we need to create this file so you can see that i have given the ec2 instance count is equal to 6 so why we need this file you can write in the cli itself right but when it comes to hundreds of variables so considering that you you can't overwrite everything with the cli so you here you have minimum of four variables so you can easily overwrite but uh, when it comes to the situation like a 30 variables you have in your configuration file you cannot overwrite everything so it will be the some hurdles for others so in that situation what you can do you can create a terraform.tf war file same name you can add those variables with some values whatever you require so what it will basically do it will overwrite your variable.tf file for here you can see easy to instance count i have mentioned three but here i have mentioned six which means when i give terraform plan and apply it will total create three instances normally but when i add with the terraform.tf var files what it will do it will it will take this value only it won't consider variable.tf file value it will consider terraform.tf wars file value only also like that when you go for ec2 instance type it, it is going to take normally t2.micro if you don't have terraform tf wars but here what it will do it will take a t3 small has an instance type and the region here which is going to do with api and south iphone one but i want to create in different region so i override this value with the terraform.tfwars let's see the demo so total i have main.tf file i have two security group and one ec2 instance so we have total three resources only but here you can see like i have total eight resources which is going to create which means I am going to use terraform tf wars count value instance type which is going to be 6 so 6 plus 2 uh, security group it is going to create 8 resources but here I have given in variable.tf3 but it is not care about this value it is going to take the priority value which is going to be 6 in this file so if I change this values to 10 which means i want to create ec2 instance of 10 so plus 2 uh, security group i will i will get total 12 uh, resources when i give plan here you can see like uh, there are 12 resources it is going to create which means 10 ec2 instances and uh, two security group and also you can see here it is going to taking t3 dot small which is i have given in the tfwar files so like this you can overwrite your values using terraform.tf wars i hope this video is helpful if you find this video helpful give thumbs up subscribe my channel follow for the more videos thanks for watching